Good afternoon, Wolfpack. My name is Caleb Beatty. And I'm Summer Said. Today is Wednesday, August 21st, and we're here with your afternoon announcements. Tomorrow, August 22nd, is back to school night from 6 to 7.30 p.m. in the MP room. Hope to see you there. Also, tomorrow, there is going to be a senior meeting at 5 after school in the MP room. Make sure to wear your orange this Friday, August 23rd, for Spirit Day and to support the football team in their match against Vanden. JV starts at 5 p.m. and Varsity starts at 7.15 p.m. Interested in buying some Spirit wear? Well, you're in luck. The student store has now an online store where you can purchase items such as polos, sweatshirts, hoodies, windbreakers, and much more that will only be exclusive for purchase via online. But be quick, as the store closes on September 6th. For more information, check your Synergy email. Now, let's pass it on over to Mara and Devin for sports. Hey there, Wolfpack. I'm Devin Steffen. And I'm Mara Schrantz. And, and this, this is, is your, your first, first sports, sports update. update. To start things off, we have our cross-country team, whose season has started up not too long ago and already have a meet today at Frogtown. So, so good, good luck, luck team. team. Staying in the realm of school sports, we have our girls' volleyball having their first home game against the Rosemont Wolverines. JV's at 5.30 and VAR is at 6.30. So, good, good luck, luck on, on your, your first game. game. And speaking of first games, we have our first football game this Friday as well against Vanden. Which will be a rematch from last preseason. You guys got this. On the topic of football, the NFL preseason has also started back up, and the results of the game were quite surprising. With the 49ers beating the Saints, the Broncos destroying the Green Bay Packers, and many more matchups, I'm quite anxious to see how this year's plays out. Me too. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. He's Devin. And she's Mara. Let's back, go back, back to, to the, the anchors. Thanks for the update, guys. Later this week, we'll be having Picture Day. Last name starting through A through L is tomorrow, Thursday, and M through Z is on Friday. Both days will be held in the small gym. Next week, auditions start for the fall musical, Zombie Prom. You can try out no matter your skill level. The auditions will take place August 27th and 28th from 3.45 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. in the Black Box Theater. Here's Ms. Chizik with information about the auditions. Hey Wolfpack, it's Ms. Chizik. I'm the theater arts teacher here at CO. I want to personally invite you to come try out for Zombie Prom. It is our fall musical. We have tryouts August 27th and 28th. You do not need to prepare anything. We will teach you a song and a dance and come check it out. Um, we're very excited to work on this one hour 1950s comedy. It's a parody on everything and we have zombies and prosthetic makeup. We're really looking forward to it. And I have a student choreographer on board, Zoe Milburn, and we're very excited to share this with you. So, this will be held in the black box in November, but we hope you come to tryouts next week. I also want to take this time and introduce our spring musical, which is very exciting. We will be doing Hades Town Teen Edition. This is the Greek myth of Orpheus and Eurydice um, and her journey back out of Hades Town. It has a lot going on. It is sung through all the way. And it really talks about that work-life balance or maybe school-life balance for you guys. And we hope that you'll come to workshops when we have them in December. Thank you. For more information, contact Ms. Chizik or visit HE5. Now, let's head on over to entertainment. Good afternoon, Wolfpack. This is Joseph Jefferson. And I'm Mehan Dillon, and this is your first entertainment update. First off, recently, on July 26th, the movie Deadpool and Wolverine dropped. Its release has been followed with an overwhelmingly positive reaction from millions, and resulting in a whopping $1.2 billion in profit, breaking a 20-year record to become the highest-grossing R-rated film in history. 
Recently, the new Borderlands movie released. However, it's received very negative reactions, receiving a 4.3 out of 10 on IMDb and a measly 10% on Rotten Tomatoes. To compensate the creators of the Borderlands game, uh, Gearbox Software is releasing a new game in 2025 to hide the movie shame. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Joseph Jefferson. And I'm Mayhem Dumont. Let's go back, back to, to the, the anchors. anchors. Thanks, guys. Well, that's all we got for you today, Wolfpack. Have a great rest of your day. My name is Caleb Beattie. And I'm Summer Said. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is pack. Happy, Happy Senior National Senior, Senior Citizen, Citizen Day, day Wolfpack. Pack.